We were supposed to be joined by uh, Blue Moon harmonicas from uh, Clearwater, Florida in the USA. Unfortunately, Mr. Tom Halchak over there couldn't join us, but he has sent something over that he'd like us to uh, present. So I'm just going to I'm just going to run through some stuff, tell you about Blue Moon harmonicas, who they are, what they do and where they started. So, well, uh, yeah, uh, located in Clearwater, Florida, USA. Uh, Tom Halchak is the sewn owner. So when you deal with Blue Moon, you're not only talking to an underling, you are talking directly to the owner. Tom started Blue Moon in 2009 when he noticed a big demand for custom harmonica combs. Nobody seemed to be doing a very good job filling in that need. Uh, so as soon as he started offering his products, he was embraced by the harmonica community. Apparently his instincts were correct when he perceived that harmonica players were hungry for a reliable source of quality custom combs. Tom owes most of his success to the feedback, coaching and encouragement he has received from his customers. It truly has been a collaborative effort as his customers, the market, if you will, acted as a de facto research and development team and quality control department. After a couple of years of strictly offering custom combs and covers, uh, Tom started dabbling with building custom harmonicas. Tom took advantage of the plethora of information uh, available to us all via YouTube, Facebook, and a myriad of harmonica-focused websites uh, to learn the skills necessary to become a top customizer. He also participated in numerous harmonica workshops and has become a fixture at the annual SPA convention in the US. Blue Moon has also tapped into a couple of other interesting markets. Tom noticed that harmonica players have a certain uh, reverence for vintage pre-war harmonicas. Lots of chat about those things, particularly the Hona Marine Band, 1896 or so, started searching for them and buying them up wherever he could find them. Over the past nine to 10 years, uh, Tom has resurrected and restored many hundreds of vintage harps and have placed them into the hands of harmonica players all over the world. It is a special thing to find these, uh, put these fine instruments back into circulation where they are doing what they are meant to do make beautiful music. Uh, Blue Moon is also the sole authorised agent for the Sunny Terry estate. Uh, working closely, closely with Dolores Boyd, uh, Sunny Terry's niece and owner of the estate, uh, Tom has helped to distribute dozens of Sunny's personal harmonicas, the very harmonicas he used in his performances and to record with. The estate has gifted harmonicas to a number of prominent musicians who has helped keep Sunny's music alive through their performances, writing and teaching. The state has worked closely with the World Harmonica Festival and the uh, World Harmonica Museum in Trossingen, Germany, which now features a permanent Sunny Terry exhibit. Now in his 11th year in business, Tom says that he is having more fun and is busier than he ever expected to be with Blue Moon. It is his passion and his pleasure to serve harmonica players everywhere. And ladies and gentlemen, please, please go and check out the fabulous stuff that Blue Moon. I don't have one myself, but I have friends who do. And I've heard nothing but absolutely great things to them. I believe that um, Jason Ritchie has them. And uh, they're, they're, uh, check out any Facebook feed. As soon as someone mentions Blue Moon, it's absolutely, you know, I've never seen any bad press. It's all been absolutely fabulous. So please check out www.bluemoonharmonicas.com. And have a look at some of the Sunny Terry stuff, uh, www.sunnyterry.net. Yeah, Ballard, I see that Ben, wonderful Ben Reese, our, uh, our technical producer, has put the links in our chat.